we're on the Essex border and it is a unique place. Um, I don't know what when these buildings were made but they're very typical of this area and for me they're very beautiful probably because these were the uh, things I grew up with but just look at that building there and uh, behind it is a big Wellingtonian they come from uh, America so they've been introduced but a lot, of, a lot of this area was parkland and so they planted these trees so before Harlow was built it was probably a couple of villages I think this part was called Burnt Mill the railway station was Burnt Mill station and not far if you go along the river you see this parkland and so I imagine that you know this was owned by rich landowners and cultivated as park parkland uh, I think the soil as I said it's London clay but there's also a lot of gravel uh, so I've heard that there was a lot of gravel pits and things like that so probably it wasn't suitable for agricultural development uh, uh, which means which explains why it's been so relatively untouched and behind that it's completely different now but there used to be a place for roller skating but it's not there anymore um, so I think I'll end the video here I just turn around and go slowly uh, just to give you an idea of what this park look like, looks like and it's particularly nice because it's spring eh? but autumn's very nice too because you have the cherry trees and they have this beautiful gold colour in the autumn eh? so that's Harlow Town Park thank you for listening